G'day and welcome back to another gas walkthrough. Today we're looking at March 2nd, 2025's RSL. Uh, not the retired servicemen's so, so, yeah, league uh, for Australians, I guess. There's probably... R I don't, are there other RSLs other, in other places in the world? Probably England. That is where like old people go. Um... Oh, uh, it's very hard to record yourself for YouTube videos um, and uh, try and introduce yourself to people and be like, hey, this is how my brain works. And then sometimes people get to see how your actual brain works and it's just slander of the English like so often. It's crazy. Um, we are gas, genuinely approachable Sudoku. I, I'm Bill, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that. Hello. If you knew, uh, this is probably not the best example. But, yeah, that's fine. Um, we're gas, genuinely approachable Sudoku. We create, set, and solve genuinely approachable Sudoku for you, the person watching this. Uh, you will find the link to today's puzzle in the description down below. You will also find hat times. Two hats is a very fast time. One hat is for a pretty fast time. And everyone gets a dinosaur because we love you all equally. Um, how you doing? Uh, yeah. Um, sorry. I... If I, if I look up, it's because uh, everyone's favorite TV chef, uh, Nigella Lawson, is on TV. And, yeah, sorry. Uh, whew. Uh, look, you know, you, you have days at work where you get home and you're like, oh, I don't know if I want to record a YouTube video. Um, I don't know if my heart's in it. And then uh, some days you're just distracted for other reasons. Uh, let's get into today's solve. Uh, so... Uh, this is an R uh, RSL, or region some lines, so normal Sudoku rules apply. Each box, each row, and each column uh, must contain the digits 1 to 9 once each. Now, uh, in the grid, we have a bunch of blue lines, so just like that one, um, and this one. And they all pass through boxes. Now, along each line, uh, digits within, uh, digits along the line and in each region it passes through, must have the same sum. So, uh, this 2 and 3 make 5, so 4 must have a 1. 4 and 1 make 5. Um, so, yeah, gang, that's basically uh, that's basically it. Um, that's all you need to know to solve... Oh my god, Nige Sorry, I've just looked up. Uh, Nigel is making a burrito. It's crazy. Okay, um, that's it. That's all you need to know to solve today's puzzle. Uh, and... That being said, I'm going to get into it and try and uh, put my whole focus on number puzzles. Um, yeah, let's do it. So, uh, th that being said, I'm resisting the urge to just do a very good Nigella impersonation. I'll do it in a second. Alright, so we know that uh, along this line, uh, it has to sum to 5. So, 2 and 3, we need a 4 and a 1 across there. Now, because I've got a 1 there, the only way you can make 5 is 2 and 3. That 3 tells us which way around this goes. Along this line, it has to be a 4-1 because we've got a 2 there. Uh, so, 4 and 1 is how that goes. Now, 2 and 7 mean this has to be 3 and 6. 4 and 9 means this has to be 5 and 8. And 4 and 7 mean this has to be 9 and 2. Yeah, sorry, itchy nose. Um, now, uh, I get a lot of people complaining about, well, I'm not complaining, they're just like, oh, how do you solve that fast? I wish I could solve that fast. Um, and unfortunately, uh, all the answers, uh, for it suck. Uh, it is, um, ooh, practice, practice, practice. But, um, if I can teach you hopefully something tonight, it's blocking. Um, now, what do I mean by blocking? Well, this line has to have a sum of 2 and 8. Now, across there means this also has to sum to the same thing as 2 and 8, which is 10. And now, you could go through and work out, um, ooh, it's 2 and well, two and 8, 1 and 9, 3 and 7, or 4 and 6. But for two cell cages, what I tend to do is I just tend to go, it needs a low number and a high number. Um, so if I can't put two, three, or four on that line, it means this has to be one and nine. One here tells me which way around that goes. Uh, same thing. Can I do the same thing there? Uh, for nine? Oh, not quite. Maybe later. Oh, I can do it later, actually. Uh, like right now. But first, uh, this has to be, uh, one and six. 
because two and three are already taken, so that's one and six for my seven totaling line. Along here for my 11 totaling line, uh, once again, I'm looking for, you know, five, seven, and nine, uh, meaning this has to be three and eight. Uh, along this line, I need a low digit and a high digit to sum to nine. Can't have one, two, or three, so it has to be four and five. The four there tells me which way around that goes. Uh, seven, eight, and nine left in that box. Can't do anything about that, but, uh, this time I'm going to look for low digits. Two, four, and five to make 11 mean that this has to be three and eight. Uh, ugh. uh, one, it's okay, gang. It's an ad break. Um, oh, no, never mind. The ad break's over. Uh, <laughs> is this entertaining? I have no idea. Uh, five and seven to make 12. Uh, all right. Uh, two, three, and four along as seeing this 11 line, I mean this has to be five and six. So six and five, uh, along here to make 13, look at my high digits, seven and eight, tell me that this has to be four and nine. We can actually resolve that already. Lovely. L lovely tell your mother. Um, all right. Uh, I think that's just a Lee Mack impersonation, which is possibly not the best. Uh, not the most satisfying. Definitely not a Nigella impersonation. Uh, this is 13, so nine and six mean that this has to be five and eight. Uh, that's what I mean when I'm chunking things, gang. So if it sounds like I'm going fast, it means I know that I'm just scanning for one digit to eliminate the whole pair. Um, I that's, that's just how uh, my brain works, four and seven. I really wish uh, sometimes my brain worked a bit differently. Uh, seven and one, uh, two and four. Oh God, okay. He won't ever see this, but um, I ran into a dude who used to work at the place I work at and he calls himself a science communicator. Um, and he tried to be like, are you a facilitator or a communicator or a teacher? And I'm like, buddy, you, uh, sorry, internally, I'm like, buddy, I cannot believe you call yourself a facilitator, uh, oh, a science communicator, because I've seen your documentation and you can't communicate anything. All right. Um, wow. I'm just full of uh, haterate. Wait, what? That's not right. Uh, one and eight. Sorry. Um, I'm just full of haterade tonight. I don't know why. All right. Um, three, nine, uh, seven and six. Uh, this has been RSL Sudoku by Clover. Um, the opinions contained in this video are not representative of uh, Gas HQ as a whole. Yeah, um, wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a fantastic rest of uh, your morning, afternoon, evening, good night. You know, something like that. My name is Bill Murphy, and I'll see you next time. Bye.